The story confirmed by Ramona Shelburne and Michael Wright says the Spurs are shopping LaMarcus Aldridge for a top 10 pick in tonight's draft. I believe that first came from uh, Mr. Miko. Anyway, uh, Aldridge has one more year plus a player option on his $84 million deal. Paul, would you trade a top 10 pick <coughs> for soon to be 32 year old LaMarcus Aldridge, I believe next month? I wouldn't trade LaMarcus Aldridge for me. <laughs> Listen, LaMarcus Aldridge <laughs> show for you now. <laughs> for, for me now, if 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 I was still playing, and San Antonio said we'll give you LaMarcus Aldridge for Paul Pierce, I'm turning that down. If I'm <laughs> if I'm Doc, I'm like no deal. And, and I and I don't I didn't play that. Were much you this that year. unimpressed I during the playoffs? I, listen, this is a guy who's. We had so many expectations for him. The Kawhi uh, combination with LaMarcus and Tony Parker, Ginobili. And it's just like what I saw from him in the playoffs was a player that was unenthused, wasn't excited to play, didn't give his all. I mean, I, I, it's just like his motor's not there no more. Because I, I really love LaMarcus Aldridge in Portland. I, I thought he was at one point the best power forward in the league. And to just watch him this year, it's just like he doesn't seem excited about the game. And... You know, it would be hard for me to trade for him right now. Typically, when a player is coming to the end of his contract, you get concerned. This is a little bit the inverse. Aldridge has one year left, and then he's got a player option. Right. So and The Spurs are kind of worried he's going to pick it up. <laughs> um, so this wow. is a second. I think the price on Aldridge will come down, not because of the way he played in the playoffs. The Spurs have big plans for this summer. They want to see if they can get in on Chris Paul, on Kyle Lowry, maybe guys we don't even know yet. And they already got a break when Paul Gasol opted out. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Opted out. And <laughs> if they could move, if they could move off um, Aldridge's contract, it would open up the cap space that they can do just about anything. So this is a, a dual thing that they've got going on here. How does it happen to a player, though, Paul? Because I think we all saw him in Portland. And look, the word on why he left Portland is, hey, he wanted to be the guy. He wanted his yeah. own team. Damian Lillard was getting so much shine. So if you are that aggressive about wanting to be that person, and you get to the environment like San Antonio with pomp and, and everyone has flowered and flourished there. Everybody knows that's not the, what you're going to get when you go to San Antonio. You know, he wants to be the guy. He wants the, the center of attention. You know that's not happening in San Antonio. So you went there because you wanted to be a part of something different. You probably didn't like Damon Lillard. I don't know their relationship. Right. You know, you want to be in a better environment you, where you can win. But he just doesn't look motivated. You know, and and. and this is a guy who, I, I, like I said, I thought he was the best power forward in the league pro as soon as three years ago. Right. And so I just, I, I just don't see a trade happening to him for anything of value. And so, you know. Certainly not a top 10 pick. Certainly wow. not a top 10 pick. No offense to you this past season. I would make that deal. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> but I do understand your larger point. And it would worry me if I was another GM. If you can't succeed under Greg Popovich, what does that tell me? Well, he has so. played well. They're just concerned about where he's going to be going forward. I, I don't want to make it sound like he – I understand he, he – It's just that you have, you have expectations for this guy. You looked at him as a superstar. Right. A combination with him and Kawhi, this is their one-two punch. And it, it just seemed like he's regressed this year. Just this year. I thought last year he was phenomenal. But just this year, you, you expected him to be better another year in the system, and he just regressed.